Hi, welcome to The Review with Mahavash. Today we'll be reviewing the film Collateral Beauty. Now, I recently was invited by Vox Outdoor Galleria to watch this movie in their experience. And first I'm going to talk about the film, how I liked it. And then I'm going to talk about how I liked the experience of watching uh, a film under the big blue sky. Now, the film itself is a complete disaster. Don't bother watching it because it's not something that will uh, make you think because there's not a lot of uh, actual substance in the film. There's a lot of uh, hollow philosophy. There's a lot of new age uh, pseudoscience that we like to call it self-help 101 is what uh, what they've basically chosen the dialogue to go with unfortunately for us and unfortunately for the film we weren't really getting invested in the characters even though being a parent I did cry at the end of the film because I did feel for Will Smith and he's done such an amazing job he's done an outstanding job as as the father of uh, of a dead child and we do feel the pain in his eyes and his, in his performance but unfortunately the the plot and the writing and the overall theme of the story is so weak that you just can't buy into the character's uh, depression and his ordeal. The cast is so power-packed. There's Edward Norton, there's Kate Winslet, there's Michael Peña, there's Helen Mirren. I mean, what are these amazing, uh, you know, actors even doing in a film like this? How did they sign on? What did they think they were signing on to? Did they not read the script? I mean, all of them have such fascinating and such amazing uh, filmographies. So why would they choose to do a film like like this. Now talking about the experiences watching a film outdoor under the big blue sky um, you know when we were kids we used to go into these drive-in cinemas where we would drive into our car and just park our cars in front of the big screen and that would be a, a very different experience and I remember that and some of that experience sort of came back to me when I watched uh, Collateral Beauty at uh, Vox Cinemas. Now I only wish that I had I had been watching a better film but otherwise the experience was really nice. Um, initially it takes some getting used to because if you're used to watching films in IMAX or 3D or into those giant screens with you know just closed closed off sounds um, it, it gets a little bit weird like you, you struggle to keep your focus but the fact is that the weather was so nice and the services were really great when you buy your ticket you get sort of like a food package and the food package comes straight to your desk there's a lot of space to sit comfortably so the food tray is right in front of you and if you've got a nice jacket which if you need they will provide for you they'll, they'll provide a nice little uh, blanket for you so if you've got that I think Think it's a really nice experience and you can definitely try it out for a romantic date so yeah definitely I'm gonna go there for a better movie <laughs> next time definitely uh, the film is not so great but you can go watch it if you're if you generally have nothing to do on a weekend uh, take care of yourself thank you for listening to this review and thank you Vox for inviting me to watch this film take care of yourself have a nice day bye